Hi everyone, today we have this Brunel Hardness Tester from Innova Test with the model number Nexus 3200. So this system comes with a 6.5 inch of a HD touch screen which uh, comes with uh, Windows 7 embedded as well as uh, a 32 GB SSD for data storage and other connectivities such as USB RS-232 and Wi-Fi. The load range for this uh, 3200 will be 62.5 kg force all the way up to 3000 kg force and it also comes with a Brunel indent optical scanner which is used to measure the diameter of the indentation during the measurement and uh, to provide the results so uh, we have the touchscreen panel over here then there's a USB port for data transfer and this will be the indenter whereby you can change uh, depends on your requirement uh, it is available in a 10mm, 5mm as well as 2.5mm bowl and this will be the sample stage for you to put on your samples and this will be the spindle whereby you can turn uh, up and down to adjust the position so uh, this will be the the uh, Brunel indent optical scanner and then uh, as well as there's some additional connectivity ports over here such as uh, USB uh, and uh, RS-232 uh, so the switch will be here and we will try uh, we will turn on this machine now so this 3200 comes with uh, impressions uh, software from Innova Test is preloaded inside so now we are going to start this uh, software So you will reach this page whereby you just need to key in the uh, admin for the username and press enter and it will bring you to the, uh, the main page for this uh, software. So this is the main page of the impressions uh, software for this uh, 3200. At the first step you can see uh, the word Brunel whereby you can choose uh, different um, diameter of uh, indenter depends on your configuration as well as uh, different force so uh, for this instance we will be choosing a 10 mm ball with uh, 3000 kg of force next you will see uh, archive so uh, it will save uh, you can save all the measurements uh, into different uh, archive as shown here then you can uh, load it back uh, anytime whenever you need it so at the next tab, uh, there's a tester whereby you can find uh, the information uh, such as uh, serial number, the software version, etc. Uh, under this tab. And then next will be uh, the system whereby uh, it will be uh, settings for the language, uh, for the users, password, uh, logout and asset. And the last tab will be service whereby it is uh, only used uh, during uh, servicing or calibration uh, from our uh, service engineers so the display on the left as you can see uh, it will be the place for the readings after you have uh, finished the measurement and then uh, since it's a 10 mm indenter so it will be uh, 10 uh, slash 3000 which means uh, 3000 kg of force is uh, used here so then you can see the D1 and D2 which will be uh, the diameter of the indentation which will be shown after you have uh, done the measurement as well as uh, uh, at the bottom you can see all the previous readings that you have done 
as well as the average standard deviation as well as the minimum and maximum readings that you have done before so at the bottom part uh, the first column it will be the first and second column will be conversion whereby you can choose uh, different uh, hardness scales based on your requirement uh, for example you can change from a Brinell HP to a Vickers or to a Rockwell uh, A, B, C scale etc depends on your uh, requirements and then the next will be the dwell time whereby you can change uh, from uh, 10 to other uh, time that uh, you needed as well as the last one it will be the mode whereby uh, normally we will just uh, set it to uh, automatic mode so uh, further down uh, you can see that there's a save button it's for you to save all your readings into the archives and the next uh, tab will be escape which uh, serves as uh, something like a back button and then as well as delete for delete any uh, unwanted measurements and program is for you to uh, save uh, different programs uh, for example if you have uh, different samples which requires uh, different uh, load as well as uh, indenter so you can save them into various programs and just uh, load them uh, depending on uh, whichever samples that you are testing and then uh, the measure tab is uh, for you to uh, measure the indentation once uh, uh, the measurement is done and now it's uh, blank because uh, there's no measurement done so you can press the escape which serves as a back button as mentioned then uh, for print you can uh, uh, print the results as uh, it will auto generate a report whereby you can just print it directly if it's connected to a printer or you can save it uh, to your USB uh, disk or thumb drive and the last type will be limits whereby you can change the upper and lower limit for this uh, system again depending on your uh, samples and requirement and at the bottom part uh, there will be an indicator which shows you uh, what is the force uh, applied uh, at that moment during the measurement as well as you can also, also uh, adjust the light brightness uh, depends uh, on your requirement so without further ado let us uh, proceed to do some sample testing so we are going to run uh, a test uh, using this uh, test block from Innova test which has a uh, brilliant hardness scale of 188 and is using a 10 mm indenter as well as 3000 kilograms of force and it has a 0.5% of tolerance so first you just need to put the test block onto the sample stage and find a clean surface for it and then you can turn up the spindle and let the sample surface touch the indenter So once the sample surface already touched the indenter, uh, turn further upwards and until the sufficient force is uh, reached and then it will turn green at the indenter, then you can uh, just uh, let the process uh, run by itself. And as you can see, the force is being uh, applied as shown in the indicator which is around uh, 3000 kg of force so now it is uh, dwelling for 10 seconds as our settings and once the process is done uh, the system will automatically uh, remove all the load and you can proceed to turn the spindle down So once the uh, indent 
has been done, you can remove the sample from the sample stage and use the uh, Brunel indent uh, optical scanner as shown here to measure the uh, indentation. At the same time, you will be able to see the uh, the image, the real life image uh, on the screen itself. And once you have located the located the the indentation, uh, you can press the red button to uh, capture the image, and the system will measure the diameter and give you the result. As you can see, uh, the live image is uh, being shown here. So once you have located the indent. Uh, just uh, press the right button and then uh, it will auto capture the diameter and uh, show you the readings so after you have pressed the measure button uh, on the scanner the reading will uh, straight away uh, being calculated as you can see here uh, the the reading for the test that we have done just now uh, the value is uh, 190.9 of uh, Brunel scale so it is uh, well within uh, the range of the uh, test block use so if you want to exit from this uh, program you just click system and then exit and at the desktop page, just press shutdown and the system will turn off itself. So that's it for the demo. Thanks for watching. Bye.